If you haven't yet visited the river and mini lake on Microtech, then I hope to inspire you to take to the skies and drop by. That's because it's one of the most Earth-like places in Star Citizen, which really helps with immersing yourself in the experience of this place. And clearly, the work that has gone into sculpting this unique location is substantial, and something to be celebrated. I'm Forrester, and the celebration of beauty and intrigue is exactly what the Location Spotlight series on this channel aims to do, alongside giving you some interesting places that you might like to go out and explore in the game yourself. The river and mini lake are on Microtech in the Stanton system, and one of the easiest ways to find it is to travel to New Babbage, and then set a course of around 200 degrees on your heads up display. It's a few minutes of flight time at top speed, so it's best to head up to altitude and keep an eye on the ground below. Once you're about halfway there, you'll see an ice lake below, which tells you you're heading in the right direction. At the full distance, you're looking for an area of greenery, the first you come across. Then, as you descend, you should be able to make out the meandering river, and following that to the end brings you to the small lake. As this spot is on Microtech, there is a breathable atmosphere, so you can wear your fancy clothes, although sometimes it can get a little cold. As for what you'll find here, it's all au naturel. You'll mostly travel here simply for the views. There are some harvestables scattered about, but there are probably better ways to make your money in-game than searching them out, unless you're somewhat of a collector. But one of the most exciting features of this place for would-be explorers is the potential it offers for the future. More procedurally generated locations like this that you might happen upon by chance, whether it's running water rivers, roads, or something more extraterrestrial, the technology behind this place promises much more for the future. And if that future sounds appealing to you, well, you might like to press that subscribe button, as you can expect more and more of these Location Spotlight videos to follow, and you might not want to miss out on those. If you enjoyed this video, you might press that like button to help guide me as to what you're enjoying seeing the most, and naturally, if you have any suggestions for places to showcase, I'd love to hear about them in the comments. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed, and thank you for watching.